Well, good morning guys and greetings from Tilcara, Jujuy. I think today we're going to be leaving the province a little bit early than expected because the altitude has just been wreaking havoc, especially on my dad. Today I think is like day five of like no food and just feeling really, really sick. So we've actually booked a hotel near the airport in Salta because we're flying out tomorrow and we're just gonna, you know, pack it up, load the car and leave this afternoon. We had initially planned to do a big barbecue. We wanted to do a Huhui style barbecue, show you the wines we bought and all that. And yeah, I mean, we went to the supermarket, we got the meat, we got the charcoal. So we're just, we're, we're making a quick barbecue to just eat a lunch. Um, we'll show you a bit of that, but then the goal is to just go back to Salta because we're going to be descending about 1400 meters, which is quite a bit and that should improve the situation. We had grand plans for a big asado and we were gonna stay here another night. I think you already mentioned that, but um, we bought some meat yesterday. We're gonna cook it up have a little bit and there's a dog that's been hanging around here i think we're going to feed it mm -hmm. barbecue for the dog the grill master today is out of commission you know? out of commission not yeah. feeling his best so this is a, a real travel day right here low energy feeling this is sick a, yeah guys change this, of plans this is like this is this is one of those times where it's almost like you don't even know if you should film it or not but trying to be realistic and show you what like kind of a not so great day it looks like um, none of us are feeling that good and Sharing with my friend the dog. He's already finished his first bone, my goodness. Boy. And we have a fast eater. Yeah, we're just having a quick lunch on the go. We're gonna load the car, head south. You ready for it? We are at the gas station fueling up and getting ready to start the journey south. Tim got me some Doritos, a Gatorade, Alfajor. Can't forget the Alfajor. I'm gonna be driving today so that hopefully my dad can rest a bit. He hasn't been sleeping at night. I don't know if you'll be able to sleep in the car. Let's hope. Probably not. Probably not. <laughs> Probably not. Probably not. Oh man, we're all we're all dropping like flies here. My stomach yeah. is a bit weird today. Uh, you've had a sore throat. Yeah. And um, yeah, we had a great time up north, but our, our health is failing us, so we yeah. are we are leaving a night early. Going back to sea level. Yeah, we're not quite, no, but tomorrow. Fourteen hundred meters lower. And so, then tomorrow. Then tomorrow we'll be at sea level. Yeah. So yeah, that's the plan. I'll be driving. Right. So basically, we we found a hotel slightly outside of Salta, nearby the airport, mm -hmm. and um. Yeah, we got about three hours to drive. Nom, 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 nom. We're rolling. Welcome to our hotel here in the outskirts of Salta. We conveniently chose a property that's maybe like five minutes from the airport, so getting there tomorrow is going to be super easy. Yeah. But yeah, I think I had a good drive. Three hours. I drove the you whole did well. way. You did really well. Mm -hmm. uh, it was nice because we were able to avoid uh, going back through Salta City. Oh yeah, we didn't have to deal with downtown traffic. My yeah. goodness. So yeah, I should tell you, we got an excellent deal on this place. We found it on booking.com this morning. Like while we were eating breakfast, we were looking yeah. for hotels and we paid $25 per room. 27. 27, okay, $27 <laughs> guys, per room. Yeah. But it includes half board, so that yes. means dinner tonight and then breakfast the following morning. Yeah. So I mean, 27 divided by two. That's yeah. less than $14 per person for a place uh, yeah. to sleep and two meals. Yeah, for us. And then you basically, your dad is, is the full 27, but he has his yeah. own room. He has, yeah. uh, he has three. 
<laughs> he has three beds in his room. He does. Nice, spacious his room. rooms are huge. And um, aside from that, we're gonna how we're gonna do this this vlog at this point. It's gonna be travel vlog, and we're gonna take oh. we're gonna take you to Buenos Aires. So we're well, gonna show you the flight, Aires. and we're gonna head back to the capital. Our time in northern Argentina has basically come to an end. That's it. Goodbye, yeah. Salta. Goodbye, Salta. We spent quite a bit of time here. We were in. Uh, we started in Tucumán, yeah. and then we came to Salta province for a while, and then we were in Jujuy. Overall, really good. I mean, our, our health failed us a bit near the end. Oof. <laughs> but uh, luckily, today finally is the first day I'm doing better. Yeah. Because uh, I'm taking some antibiotics. Yeah and uh, I'm on my third pill and it's a uh, day and night uh, difference. Yeah. These past four days, it was just a horror, horror story. We thought it was the altitude sickness, mm -hmm. but it wasn't. It was some sort of a bug or uh, some sort of, a, yeah. I don't know, something. You had it for four or five days. Yeah, oh. and it was extremely debilitating because diarrhea, nausea, and you feel like vomiting and your strength is depleted, I mean, oh. to the point you cannot even stand up, so. It's just the worst. Yeah, this is the worst. Now I'm back to kind of uh, normal. We came down 1400 meters yesterday. Yeah. And I mean, salt is still fairly high up, but it's just considerably lower than Hujuy. Yeah. And today we're flying to basically close to sea level in Buenos yeah, Aires. Yeah, we're so. going to sea level. So. And uh, well, if you come and visit and you go over up to the uh, mountain areas or whatever, and you happen to get sick, yeah. don't forget that here in Argentina, you can go to your local pharmacy yeah. and talk to the pharmacist. And in most cases, he can prescribe you, uh, like we got some antibiotics and stuff like that. Thanks God, because uh, that's what saved the day. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's and, not uh, as uh, strict yeah. as in some other countries like Canada. If you don't have a prescription, forget it. the pharmacy only over the counter uh, medication, mm -hmm. the rest, forget it. But here is more uh, lax. And, yeah, uh, you can save a vacation, let's say, you know. Yeah, I mean, yesterday's decision to come here was probably one of the best uh, things we decided on the whole trip. We've all got healthy. We all had a really good sleep last night. We weren't rushed to leave in the morning. Yeah. And this was a nice place, uh, the A-Ball Hotel. Fa fabulous hotel right next yeah. to the airport. We got a nice dinner, a nice breakfast. The price, it's just, I, I couldn't believe it because <laughs> by the price that uh, you pay here for that double room, yeah. you get uh, dinner. Yeah. And breakfast uh, yeah. with a lot of stuff in that breakfast, eh? Oh, it's great. Ham, cheese, fruits, fruit salads, uh, croissants, coffee, whatever. Even a swimming pool, and it's a locked-in uh, yeah. area secure, where secure uh, place. there is no access for other people. So oh. if you have the chance and you need to stay here, yeah. close to the airport, this is yeah. the spot. And now so. we've got a flight. We've got Norwegian Air, a budget flight back to, uh, to Buenos Aires. And, and I think... That's it. I think, you know, if we're all feeling good enough, we're going to go out for a nice meal tonight, too. So, it'll yeah. be the first time in a while that all three of us have been able to go out for dinner. Yeah. It's going to be great. Yeah, I got some northern Argentine food. My last chance to do so. Three empanadas, a cup of wine, all special for 210 pesos. That's like just over three bucks. Mm -hmm. So, a good deal. This makes a nice little snack. We're going to be having probably steak tonight so oh, we don't want to blow we don't want to blow it for lunch Yeah, we made it to Buenos Aires back, and uh, we had a beautiful flight, eh? Oh, it's great. That uh, Norwegian airline is amazing. I mean, they're, they're, they're very uh, 
courteous, eh? They, yeah, they really they're really take care of the people, the passengers. Yeah. We had a beautiful flight. The flight was not full, so these guys were able to switch uh, seats. Yeah, we had, our whole, we had a whole row. To yeah. We each had like entire rows to ourselves. Yeah, entirely. Yeah. Entirely. Yeah. So it was awesome. a nice, smooth ride. Yeah. You were able to film a lot from the window, eh? When we were descending, we went by uh, one, probably one of the wealthiest neighborhoods in the whole uh, in the whole city oh, or province. Yeah. Nordelta. Yeah, it's it, 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 it's it's basically like a I don't even know how you would describe it. It's like a manicured pond area. With yeah, it's a man-made uh, man, artificial yeah. artifi reclaimed land, lakes and, and stuff like lakes. that. Lakes. Yeah, I've never seen so many swimming pools. Yeah, we made it to the city. We are in the apartment. And now, ta -ta -ta -ta, we're going for a piece of meat, yeah. parrilla, yeah. something. Okay. My stomach is doing much better, so I can <laughs> attack a, a piece yeah, of we, something. Yeah, we, we've been waiting to do this for a while, and yeah. so uh, we're going we're gonna to really enjoy a nice meal. The three yeah. of us can actually eat and eat well. I and, won't uh, be able to have any wine because of the antibiotics, but at least I'll, 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 I'll drink yours for you. Yeah, that's it. Don't ask for a big bottle, that thing, you know, you need to ask for a half. I'll we'll be doing it all myself. Yeah. Right. Dinner has arrived. What are we having? It sure has. Well, I'm sharing some steak with my dad because these are monster pieces of meat. We got, which one? Beef de chorizo? Beef de chorizo. Beef in Argentina, how can you go wrong? Okay. And for me, after four days of uh, nothing in the stomach, today, I'm in heaven, you know. What did you get, Sam? I got the exact same thing. The only difference is mine is a beef and chorizo, but it comes with a sauce on top. It's basically a baked potato loaded with cheese and bacon. So. Ooh la la. How thick that is, guys. And juicy, hello. This is how I like it. We've gone to a lot of steakhouses and almost all of them have been incredible. So you can eat pretty much confidently anywhere in the city and get a, a, a good cut of meat. Well guys, that is a wrap for this vlog. This video spanned two days, so it's a pretty long one. We hope you enjoyed watching along and tomorrow we head over to a new country. We are crossing over to Uruguay. Sam's the only one who's been there before. My dad and I are visiting for the first time. So it should be fun. We're gonna be there for a week. We plan to visit a few different places, so stay tuned for that. We're going to bed now because we have an early start tomorrow. So, see you then.